Good morning. I think we're going to have to switch things up a little bit here. Go for the handheld. Hold it. All right. Good morning. Welcome back to uh, school after our Easter weekend. And of course, we know in our church we celebrate Easter as an octave. So eight days where we celebrate Easter just like it was yesterday. And so Easter stays and then our Easter season is 50 days long uh, until the ascension. And so you may see our, our Easter altar that we have set up here today. Um, we got this set up over the weekend, and we're going to keep it up this week since we celebrate Easter all week long. So we've got a few jokes today. Um, I didn't have any sent in to me this week, and so most of these jokes today came from Alexa this morning um, that, we, uh, that we looked up. So we'll run through those real quick. Um, we tried to find a couple of Easter jokes, but uh, but it was hard. We didn't find too many good ones there. All right. Um, what do you call a cow with a twitch? Beef jerky. Beef jerky. Good job. Um, how is duct tape like the force? It has a light side and a dark side, and it holds the galaxy together. Our, our two... Easter jokes. Um, why did the Easter Bunny eat his gold necklace? Because it was 24 carats. And why did the baby chick cross the road? To get to his peeps. To hang out with his peeps. Good job. All right, and this was the favorite um, Alexa joke from this morning. Um, I think our parents might appreciate this one right now at AMI. How many siblings does it take to change a light bulb? Zero, because the time they're done fighting, mom and, I, mom and dad have already done it. So that was the favorite in our house today. All right, we'll get started with our morning prayer. of those who seek the Lord rejoice. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, call on his name. Make known his deeds among the peoples. Sing to him, sing praises to him. Tell, tell of all his wonderful works. Let the hearts of those who seek the Lord rejoice. There's no Alleluia today because it's not a gospel. A reading from the second book of Samuel. David said, The Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my deliverer. My God, my rock, in whom I take refuge. My shield and the horn of, the, of my salvation. My stronghold and my refuge. My Savior. I call upon the Lord, who is worthy to be praised. In my distress, I call upon the Lord. To my God I call. From his temple he heard my voice, and he, and my cry came to his ears. Indeed you are the lamp, O Lord, the Lord. Light, light ends the darkness. This God, this way is perfect. The promise of the Lord proves true. He is a shield for all who take refuge in him. For who is God but the Lord? And who is the rock except our God? The Lord lives. Blessed be my rock, and exalted be my God, the rock of my salvation, the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Think about the silently in your heart. What should we thank God for, for in our prayers this week? Let us pray to God for our needs and the needs of others, our family, neighborhood, and the world. 
For each need we say, Lord, hear our prayer. For all the members of the St. Joseph community, that we will be successful in our studies and protected from the coronavirus, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our prayer. prayer. For all health care workers, that they may have the strength and courage that they need to serve the sick, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our prayer. prayer. For all leaders who must protect others from the virus, that they have the wisdom to make the right decisions, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all people of faith, that they will find ways to grow closer to God during this time when they cannot fully practice their religion, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Let us pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary. Full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be. To the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. For you rejoice and are glad, O God, in this Easter season. We know that like Jesus Christ, we will rise to new life. Help us to be faithful followers of Jesus, and to live as he showed us. We ask this in Christ's name. Amen. Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I will try my best every day to learn to love others and to act like Jesus. All right, so as we celebrate the octave of Easter this week, we don't, uh, we don't remember our saints. We don't celebrate the saints this week because um, the, the importance of how important Easter is. And so we won't be reading our saints each day this week as we just remember Easter. Um, I do want to call our birthdays today. We have two birthdays today. Uh, Nicholas McClelland and Cassie Gall. Happy birthday today. And then our families that we remember this week are the Thomas family the Vauder family, the Vu family, the Wagaman family, and the Ward family. Um, so that's what we're going to pray for this week. Um, one thing I want to ask for you students, um, something that we're, we're going to do this week to help celebrate Easter a little bit and keep that uh, fun and special for us, is we are going to announce some kind of special uh, dress-up days, kind of a spirit week this week during Easter. So I'm going to send something out to... Uh, uh, get something out to parents and students this afternoon. It's kind of like a vote. We'll, we'll come up with a few different things like, you know, crazy hat day or crazy sock day or whatever we might come up with um, to be our spirit days for this week. So look for that and make sure you check with your parents by the end of the day about uh, voting for that. All right. Well, have a good day of AMI and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.